Um, tell me what this word means. Kizure kaketa. Hi. So kuzure kaketa is um kaketa. Kizure kaketa ie. How can you kind of in this context? It's like is doing has been kind of doesn't really add much meaning here. What does this verb mean? Kakeru, oh, ka verb. Oh, sorry, kuzureru. Kuzu kuzureru. Um, is to cr is to be rotting, to be crumbling. So it's be crumbling, to be crumbling, to be crumbling. Kuzure. Kuzure. This is a passive form. Being crumbling. Kuzure kaketa. Mm. The house that is crumbling. Hi, hi. Do you know what sagasteru means? Arika sagasteru no ka. Completely forgot money. Can't hi, remember. Sagasu is to look for something. And um, with, uh, when we have this kanji, it kind of insinuates that you're looking like you're really looking for Sorry, I'm gonna go back to this page. Is that you're looking for um uh something that you don't have, like a shigoto. Shigoto sagasu. Uh, oh, that's the that other kanji. Never mind. Ah. So this one's using more like for items that mm. you've lost. Is the one we just saw on the last page. Mm. Is this for things you've lost? That but we're gonna be seeing lost. the other sagasu. So both of these, when you're talking, same sagasu is conjugates the same. But why you might use one kanji or the other is that this sagatsu is more like for items and stuff, like something you might have lost. And the other one tends to be more something important or some idea of something, like looking for a job versus looking for your wallet. So mm -hmm. wallet, it's going to be this one, job, that one. But they're both sagatsu. So but... that top one say, imono. Can I see that top one? So it's just one say, Imono no o mitsuke dasu koto. The thing Ushinata that I'm mono? looking for. Ushinata I'm is something that was lost. Oh, hitio na mono? That's something that is important. Teni hai, um, teni mono is things that you want. So things that are important mm. and things that you want, you found it. Mits, uh, mitsuke dasu. Or you're trying to find it. Um, and then on the bottom is mm -hmm. things that are lost. Why do they say mitsuke dasu? Meaning you you saw and you found. I mitsuke dasu. Not exactly sure, but I'm assuming that its meaning is a little bit different than just mitsukeru. It just mean um mm -hmm. in this case to be um looking for because we to do is like to find something right um or to try to find something so you find it mm. it's supposed to come out um it's so nice to be able to read dictionary but in yeah. japanese <laughs> that that is that it is nice when you can find some else. so anyway this verb right here has the same kanji as that sagasu which is to find something you need or you long for um in this case though it's called saguru and sagaru means to investigate. Mm. So just this kind of fun to have those like links to things. So sagasu and saguru. So to investigate. Mm. And both of these in English are simply to to look, to search. Right, sagasu to search for, look for. Look for a job. Mm. Find a job. Um, yeah. In English we say we look to look for <laughs> rather than to search for a job. So we also do like a mm. weird separation thing. So if I said I'm searching for my, I'm looking for my, I guess we use look for both of those. Right? I'm looking for my wallet. We use for both. We yeah. don't make this distinction between things that we need versus things that we've lost. Yeah. Not that with we that are verb. Look, like I'm looking for my I'm wallet. I'm looking for my wallet. I can't I'm looking find for my a keys. job. Have anybody seen my keys? Mm. 
Um, anyway, saguru, saguru. Do you, um, can you put saguru into negative form? Mm, saguru. Saguranai. Hi, saguranai. So let's go read this. Not searching. Hi. Mario Kuno. Tehen. Something decrease, drastically decrease. Tehen or Tehen. You know what this means, but you're not pronouncing it right. It's a uh, Gekigen. Gekigen. Geki. Geki shita. Gen ni, gen in, gen in no. Sakura nake, nakereba. Nakereba. Yep, nakereba. Knife form in the kereba. Hi. Knife form in the kereba, meaning must, right? Yes. Perfect. Or if. Yep, I must saguru. Literally is, if I don't saguru. If I don't saguru. Therefore, I must Hi. saguru. I must okay. saguru. And I must saguru the gen in the cause. Hi. The cause of what? The cause of marioku no geki gen shita. Right. The decrease of magical power. Perfect. Yep. Um, can you read this word right here? Ochisuki sake. Perfect. Do you know what that means? Ochisuki sake. Ochisuki sake. To arrive at. That's a good guess. Sake can be used for some kind of arriving word. It's a destination word. Yes. Nation, but ochituki doesn't actually totally mean to arrive. Ochituki kind of means to settle. So it's the destination you settle at. A place you can calm down, take a nap in. Ochituki saki. Ochituki saki. Here we have two parts. We have the ochi, the root form of Ochiru. Hi. Fall. Then we have tsuki attached from tsukiru. Tsuku. And then we have the noun tsuku. Then we literally have the noun to tsaki. attach. Literally, it's to attach falling is the literal like verbs here. But oti tsuku um, means like the calm down. Calm down. Oti tsuku. Calm right. down. Um, I guess it, it's, is a yeah. place, and it's and it's it also a, means to settle down. You can calm down, exactly. So a place mm -hmm. you could calm down, and the words the location you'll settle in, basically your house, or a mm -hmm. hotel, or an apartment, or something like that, safe house, something like that. Mm -hmm. Um, can you read this for me? Ochitsuki tsuki o sagura ne sagura nuba. Right. So that nu not kereba not a knife. Hi hi. Mm. So now turn into nuba in old man speech. So so. Hmm. So I must search for a place to rest. Exactly. I must investigate for a place to rest. Um. Can you read this for me? Dose. Dose means state of Ooh, affairs. Uh... So basically, what's going on? Going on. Do do here, meaning movement. I know. We got do, do from movement. ugoku. And say from mm. vigorous, I think. Kyoyoku no say. I'm not exactly vigorous sure. Movement. Movement, vigorous. State of affair. How That's things are currently thing. moving. Okay. Exactly. Like, like how, how things you are doing. Moving. How you doing? Mm. How you doing? The things are moving in what way? Right. So for this verb that means hmm. to settle, what is the ta form of it? Pause like the te. 
So ochitsu, this could become ite, but it's Hai. ita. So ochitsuite. Ochitsuita. Suite. Suita. 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 Can you read this for me? This here is. Um, okay. Ya. Seki. Close. It does end with ki. The middle one was wrong. Yasiki. Yasiki. Hi. Yasiki ni ochi suita. Ochi suita. Come at the room. I calm. I calm down. Could mean that. Or I calm. I calm. Oh, no, no, it, no, no. It, Sui here mean arrival. Hi. I fall and arrive at the place, at the room. So I, you've seen this word already. This is not a new word. It can mean the calm down. That is a possible meaning of this verb. But it can also mean to settle down. So not does it only does it mean to settle down your emotions. It can also mean to settle your roots down, to go to your hotel or take a nap somewhere. You settle down. Mm. I so. settle in at the room. Hi. And room in Japanese is heya. Mm. This is house? Yes. Yashiki? But what kind of It's a yasuki. Hi. Yasuki is not mansion. like a normal house, a mansion. Hi, hi, hi. It's different than mansion in Japanese, which would be like an apartment. Okay, now you get to go read the line from the book. Yashiki ni ochisuita razugu. Ochisuita razugu. What is this ratsugu that is well, attaching helps. to the suita? So, so first up, you got suita. And you, it's good. It, theoretically, it could be rasugu. You're right. This could be a noun. And that would be theoretically possible. But it makes more sense to see this ra and assume that it's tara, right? Which is if or mm. when. Ah. When I settle in the mansions, sugu is right afterward. Almost like a talk here. Quickly. Majutsushi tachi no dose o saguraneba. I must search for the state of affair of the magician in plural. Hi. When should he when should he do this? Right away. Sugu. Hi, hi. Right away. Immediately. Basically, as soon as I settle down in my house, I got to see what's going on with those magicians. Um, do you remember how to read this word from last time we met? Mm. I meant work. You say this is like a product, but not like a physical product, but labor. Yeah, labor. It's like labor working. Hi. It was like labor. So it's sa, sa. Takusaku, saku yo. That's a good guess. This is actually Saki. yo, sagyo, kind of like jugyo, if you know that word. Right here. This is um class. Jugyo. Jugyo is class. Shikai. Jugyo. Class. Right. So we're having jugyo right so, now. So we are having jugyo right now. But this here it's sock your yep work yep sock your to the doing work right doing work I don't want to work today ba, 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 ba. got song on the head now uh do you know this kanji we say it was to clean so hi hi soji hi soji you know what yakai means? Mm -mm. Something to do with kai is like um in between, right? In between two things. No, 
not sure. I don't really see that kanji that much. Um, the first guy, ya, yeah, shows up almost in abunai, but it's uh not. Um, abunai. No, e right there, but it's kind of similar in meaning. That guy, mm. that guy is bothersome. Mean dangerous. Kind of, it's it's some kind of like bothersome is more what it is. That guy, burdensome, something like that. So very similar to mendoksai. That guy na koto is how tell you how it tends to be used. A bothersome thing. And we say that this is na adjective. Hi, it is a na adjective. Yakai. Um, can you read this for yakai me? Yakai. Yakai na. Meshi ya mesh. Mesh sky. Mesh sky. Meshi sky. Mesh sky. Meshi sky. And here, Meshi sky is. This is a noun. Hi. So, Meshi sky is. To be useful. That's a good guess. A That's servant. yaku ni tatsu. Yaku ni tatsu. Messy sky. Forgot this word. Messy sky is a servant. The word you tend to struggle with. Servant. Servant. That's not how that's spelled. It's a yakai na. Bothersome servant. So, so, a bothersome servant. And... Uh, you know what toste means? Toste. As for this, right? Basically, it's used in like as the role of kind of. So in this sentence, it's saying that hair is still in the use uh, is is used as a office. So it's basically it's it's talking about the basis of or on the use of kind of. So when we're talking about uh mm -hmm. uh that hair is being used as one could be way you could translate that. I remember the other one. What we came across ni niste. This one is doste. Doste is why. Nishi nishi te ni like. There, there's something similar to toste. I think you're thinking about niyote. Niyote, which is kind of similar, is it? But niyote is more like a personal opinion. Almost like yeah, um, niyote ni totte, something like that. <laughs> it's more like opinion, but yeah, toste mm -hmm. in the role of basically on the basis. Yeah. So here we got yaku ni tatsu word. So let's go read the sentence. Kozo wa meshi sky toste that. The boy as a servant, yakuni tachinai, not useful. Hi. Yep, so that boy, regarding his role as a servant, basically, he's not useful. Or, as a servant, not useful at all. Perfect, perfect. And now you get to go read the line from the book. Kozo wa meshi sky toshite yakuni tachi so ni nai. Yakai na dakera. The boy, as a servant, doesn't seem to be useful. So ni nai. Doesn't look to be useful. Yakke na. Bothersome. Dakera. Only. Hey. Nothing but bothersome. All he is is a burden. All he is is a bothersome. Do you know what kiken means? Danger. So, so, danger. Perfect. Ken. Ken. Can you read this for me? Ken o kasu. Hi. Ken o, Ken o, Ken o kasu. Hi. This is to brave danger. It's to see danger and be like, ooh, cool. 
Quien no caso. Heedless of danger, to brave the danger. Um, how would you put Quien no o Ocase into Tefor? Quien o Tefor of Shite. Hi. So, Quien o Ocaste. Hi. Perfect. Brave danger. Read this for me. Brave danger. Young guy. Young thing. Hi. Young my four long objects. Good guess. Good guess. That's actually <laughs> thin thing. object. Hi, thin objects. Yep, oh. like paper. Be an example of something that could be my or basically thin. anything that's almost two dimensional. So it could be paper. It could be a thin piece of metal. Shape doesn't matter, long as it's thin. Um, can you read this example sentence for me? You can all cast that. Cast that. Hey, ni. Ireta no wa. Hey, no wa. Hey, ni. Omaru. Okisa no kiken datta. No, 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 that's not kiken, that's ki. This, this is kikai. That's like a machine of some sort. So, so. Kai. Mm. It's a machine. Kai. Kai. It's, it was a machine that. Okisa. Any that fits in the hand, so, so. grabs in it. I don't know. Tomaru is okisa. The yeah. size of the size of grabbing the hand. I'm sorry, I don't know this one. Hi, it's a little hard. It's this is it's a machine that is the size that fits in the palm of my hand. So we know it's about fits in the big. hand. Oh. And and what is that? That is sorry about this. No wa. Hi hi hi. So this uh, Noah very important. So kiken o ka o kashite te ni ireta ireta Noah the thing that is currently in the palm of the hand ireta is inside right but go into it can mean that inside. literally that is correct but teni put... iredu and teni haidu means to obtain so the thing that was attained from what keno okaste from facing danger so, no I, so the Kino. thing that i obtained by but through so i braved danger and the thing that i obtained was a kikai that was about the size of the palm of my hand so that's our pronoun no right there. Oh. The thing, the one. The one that I received was this. Mm. Um, do you it's know so what this... similar to what he... Yeah. Whatever he took from, from the Lord of Twilight. It uh, seems this like, actually it is seems to from take... that. Yeah, thought, so yeah. whatever he took. So the first chapter he takes, he, he steal from Neburi. I... So I'm guessing in his mind, he's sort of kind of repeating his um his his mode is operandi basically he, he liked to steal little things so, from so people's pocket that that would that be like a uh, logical way of thinking about <laughs> it but in actuality um we've learned enough vocabulary that i'm actually having us do a previous sentence we already learned uh because i was like oh wow we got a lot of words for example we learned this one not that long ago do you remember how to read this guy gears like so, so, the teeth gears. of a will yep so it's ha hai. guruma ha guruma perfect ha guruma hi so our next word is enban enban kind of might remember n from like money or something like that is a disc like a like a could yeah. be a cd disc doesn't have to be that but it's some kind of round object that's, you know, not very thick. Some kind of disc. 
Okay. You read this example sentence for me. Yes. Um. Baguruma tsuki no enban ga yon mai suita kikai datta. It was a machine that was attached. Well, that has four discs. Uh, four thin discs attached to the attach uh what kind of a thin disc or what thin disc of gears so yeah. it was a, a machine thin that disc had four attached thin with gears there's four of them gears. the discs are the gears or the gear um, ha i'm sorry it's, it's, the it's attached so we have discs that have gears attached to them, and there's a total of four yeah. discs. Total of four discs that have gears attached to them. <sighs> that is the kind of machine it was. So, so. Next word, zolge, is ivory, which is um, okay. elephant uh, bone, like their tusks, elephant tusk. Zolge. 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 Can you read this for me? Tani. Ira. Could be that probably Ira. high though in this context. Ira not that. Okay, Tani Ira not. Ira to go into, right? Yes, but we just talked about that so, not that long ago. Oh, to obtain. So Tani so. Ira. To obtain. I did not obtain. Yep. How about the other bolded word? The other word is. No, do, do kai. Ha, do ka. Correct. What's a do ka? Do, do ka. Do ka is a uh, coin. So, copper so. coin. Copper coin. Perfect. And I want to stare at this for a second. Do you know what a zoge was? Zoge is ivory. So, so, ivory. Or oh, a tusk. Is it a tusk? Yes, it, it it's, it's uh, ivory and tusk are the same thing. Ivory just a fancy word. So this right here is the exact um, sentence that we skipped a while ago in the past. And I just thought, woo, we got all the vocabulary done. Because <laughs> last time we skipped it, because it was like just a lot of vocab words. <laughs> so um, mm -hmm. I, don't, I don't think I'm going to make you read it because we ba you ba we already did it. But, you know, just he braved danger. And the thing that entered his hand was a machine that was about the big in the palm of his hand. And it had four discs of ivory um for ivory discs with gears on them um skipping mm -hmm. that any idea to read this word that ends with my young Hi. young my my perfect can you read this word for me how many naru hi how many naru means to be stuck with something unpleasant um it is used like this in sentences can you read it for me Yakai na neshi sky o ya to wa ya to ha me ni natta. Hi. Ya to meaning long, right? Uh, ya to is to hire. Oh, hire, hire. Right. Hiring and stuck with. Wait, yato is a verb, is it? Or is it a Hi, yato is to hire a verb. So we have two verbs here. We have yato. That's a good so hame. So hame is actually a noun and nata comes from naru, which is to become with a ni being here to turn this noun into an adverb. So hame ni naru. So it is to become hame, is what this is literally saying. Um so this is actually describing this noun. So that's how it's so, but it's hard to describe this as to become burdened by that, I guess is what it is. To become burdened by hiring a useless a bothersome servant. Exactly. Yep. 
that's how it's used. So this is the, the burden comes from doing that. Perfect. And I'm going to quickly see how many more pages we got. Um, we're going to stop here and we'll continue this uh, next time we meet. Um, so um, today is Wednesday and actually this Friday uh, is my birthday. So I'm not mm -hmm. going to work. <laughs> um, oh, morning so awesome. <laughs> I can't so, wait to wish you a happy birthday. Uh, so I'm not going to work on Friday, but I will work on Saturday. So I'll see you on mm -hmm. Saturday. Does that sound good? Mm -hmm. cool. Yes. So yeah. Bye. Yes. Yeah. Have a nice Wait, money, day. Money, money, real quick. Yeah, yeah. Real quick. Stop, stop the recording. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Oh, yeah. Stop the recording. Ah.